Hello, welcome back. This is Kenshin1913, and we are Let's Playing Chrono Trigger. In the last episode, we went through various... Uh-oh. We went through various... ...things and started the game, and I apologize for the, or the low audio and uh, the low... The, uh, what else? I apologize for the... whatever. Just everything. Alright, whatever was wrong, I'm gonna fix in this, in this episode. I didn't know that it wouldn't record. You see this black bar on the bottom? I don't know why that pops up during battles. Or even scenes where... Even scenes where I'm in here. Because if you look outside when you go over here, no black bar. I don't understand. Anyways, hopefully I'll be able to fix that. Although, if I can't... You know, you just gotta have to deal with the black bar on the bottom. So this is the Millennial Fair with lean, the, in Lean Square. I heard Luca and her dad have another invention thing. They say people who hear Leanne's bell will have an interesting, happy lives. And here we have some some uh, stuff here. We can purchase healing equipment and stuff. And then over here we can purchase. Karate Gi and Bronze Helmet. Not gonna bother. Right now, maybe a little later. Those runners are so busy racing, they won't even talk to you. Oh, so this is a this is a race thing. Let me tell you, when I was a kid, I used to run around here like no one's business. And, oh, the kingdom beat this guy named Magus 400 years ago. And now things are so peaceful. Look at that. How nice. And look, we got ourselves a racer. Races. The steel runner. It looks like some soldier, a kitty, and an alien. Anyways, let's talk to this guy. Oh, okay. And this guy right here. This guy is Mechlor, the swordsmith. And we can purchase, actually, a load sword from him, which is a really good sword, but it's really expensive. I live on the continent of the East. Come see me sometime. Are you hitting on me, man? Yeah, you, there, so there was a war against the wizard 400 years ago. And yeah, there are all these cool events going on. And I'm going to check them out uh, in due time. Let's go up to the square. And look, there's a girl. Oh, shoot. What the hell, girl? Ouch, that hurt. And look, the bell's ringing. And apparently Chrono is knocked uncon- Oh, no, okay, he's fine now. Oh, no, my pendant. All right. Oh, God. Oh, man, what should I do? First thing, be a gentleman. Ask the lady how she's doing. Lady, lady, how are you, how are you doing? What'd you lose? Did you lose your pendant? Your pendant's right here. Pick it up. And give it to the girl. Oh, thank goodness. My pen has a lot of sentimental value. May I have it back? Uh, yeah, you can have it back. What the hell am I going to keep it for? I'm being a good Samaritan. Yeah, I do live in town. Yeah, you know what? You can come with me. Yeah, you're a true gentleman. Oh, by the way, my name's Er Marley. But, for the purposes of... Whatever. I'm going to name her Nadia. Alright, you'll find out why later. Just simpler that way. I'm Nadia, and you are Chrono. What a nice name. Pleased to meet you. Now lead on. Now, it is time to walk the square with Nadia. Yay! I hate fair, so did you hear the latest gossip? No. Between us, I hear the king is distressing over his tomboy daughter. Just once, I'd like to see how wild she really is. Whoa, you're... 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 Oh, you're a bitch. Let's talk to this guy. So, basically, we can purchase silver points, which will be used to... Which will be used to, uh... To play games and stuff. So, we can actually trade in our silver points for money, but I don't have any right now. So let's go over here 
talk to this girl. What's up, little girl? Where's my cat? Oh, you lost your cat? Oh no, you lost your cat. Let's look for our cat. That's what we gotta do. Oh, look. And you see this lunch over here? Don't eat it. Be a nice guy. He wants his lunch, let him eat his lunch. But look, here's the kitty. This the lost kitty. Let's bring the kitty over to uh, the little girl. Come on. There we go. Walk, not run. So the kitty can follow us. We're having adventures down in Leanne Square. And we brought back the cat. You're so sweet. Yes, I am a sweetie. Yay! You're so sweet, Chrono. Alright, so let's talk to this guy. It's a soda guzzling contest. Press A as fast as you can. Sure, I will drink soda. Wink, wink. Beer. So let's drink. Ah, uh, only six cans. I, I can never do better than six cans. You're awful competitive, aren't you, Chrono? Yeah, I like to drink soda, all right? Cavities and caffeine. And listen to this music. Yeah, hear this music? And now if we do, if we hit the various buttons on our controller, we can do it dances. And look, Nadia's joining in. How awesome. Yeah, we're doing the caveman. Alright, can I go or what? Yeah, so we can dance here. Catch the rhythm. Prehistoric dance, how interesting. La -de -de -da -da. Oh, you look at that. The oh these so those are the elders' grandkids. Can I talk to you guys or are you too busy? Jurassic Rhythm. Yeah, good stuff right here, huh? Look at that girl spinning and that guy doing his thing. Yeah, look, so we're dancing. We are dancing! Oh yeah, let's show you Nadia. She's, uh... She's, she's pretty crappy. She's, uh, she's all about... She's a healer. She doesn't know the healing spell yet, but eventually she will. And who would have thought she would join our group? So let's go over here and check out this area. Do not eat the man's lunch. Alright, it's his lunch, not yours. And here's here's Luca's robot, huh? Hey, Luca's robot. They call me Gatto, I have metal joints. Beat me up and earn 15 silver points. Yeah, all right, let's do it. So, we get into a battle with Gatto. And let's take his A out. And all you can really do right now is just hit him with, uh, with whatever uh, attacks you got. As he just pounds Chrono in the face with the thing. Oh, now he's hitting Nadia. Not nice to hit a lady. Although she... Who brings a crossbow? And look, we beat him. And Chrono went up a level. Very nice. I lost. And you won. Here's 15 points. Now, wasn't that fun? It was totally fun. I wasn't going to sing that because I didn't have it down. Alright, people. I can't sing everything. I'm not Mr. Entertainment Machine. I'm just here for funsies. So we got 15 silver points, so let's use those points. Now, you could actually... One thing you could do, which I did a long, 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 long time ago, you know, because I'm crazy as a child. I fought him so many times that I built up silver points, and I used them, and I purchased gold, and then I bought that load sword over here. It was awesome. So now let's, let's go around and have fun at the fair with our lady friend. So what we need to do here is press the A button, and try to get it to the tippity top. So close. Oh, so close. Yay! We did it. So we get a silver point. How nice. Yay! Alright, so let's talk to Mechlor again. Hey, Mechlor. What's up? 
And, uh, yeah, we can purchase things, but that's not why I talk to him. I live on the continent of the East. Come see me sometime. By the way, could you talk that young lady into selling her pendant? No, it's not mine. What do I look like, an asshole? Um, the race is on. Be quiet and watch. So let's wait until the race is over. As you can see, the uh, lizard guy won, and the kitty cat was super far behind. Come on, kitty. We're going to bet on a race. No, I want to bet on the race. Last round's winner. Green Ambler. Guess the winner. Sure. Um, let's bet on G.I. Jogger. Come on. I'm betting on G.I. Jogger. G.I. Jogger's this guy back here. Go. Go. And now I can't really... I thought there was a way that I used to... Wow. You want... Come on, man. I bet on you. Alright, I'll just win the race. Run! Yay! We won! Damn, my guy came in last. Dead last. But yeah, you get some silver points if you did that, so that's kind of cool. Let's, let's, let's bet on one more time. I want to win. I want to win. Let's try, let's try this green Amway. He won last time. Go. Go. Ready? Go. There we go. Come on, green guy. Win. Alright, you're not winning, green guy. Oh, wait, wait. Look at this. A burst of speed. Green guy and cat are neck and neck. No, cat just won. Well, if you win, I'm pretty sure you get silver points. And this is the renowned Tent of Horrors. Spend your 16 silver points here. Parental discretion is advised. So if we come over here to Nornstein Beckler's lab, the spine-tingling show is about to start. And here we can bet... We can play games for 10, 40, and 80 silver points. I think I only have 16, so we're going to just play for 10 right now. And here we go. We're going to play this game. I'm Vix. I'm Wedge. Of course, they got to have that. And I'm Petite. Now, they're going to move around. We'll find Wedge. That's a good, uh, you know what? And with the... With the power of save states, we will find Wedge. And look at that, I didn't need it. And we get a Pizoyo doll. Oh, interesting. And basically, he threw that in the room. How cool, let's go check up on it. Alright, let's show Nadia my house. Nadia, look at my house, isn't it wonderful? Here's my pretty kitty. And speaking of kitties, the kitty is walking now. And look, how nice, I've only seen you with Luca. Who's your new pretty friend? Hi, I'm Nadia! Uh, Nadia? I'm sure I've seen you before, dear. Now, where was that? Yeah, where was that? Would you like to sleep in my bed with me, Nadia? And yeah, that thing plays a song. Yeah, I want Let's take a nap. Together. Alright. So look at that, we're well rested. Now we can head back to the fair, which lasts forever. Well, not really, but a long time. So now that we've uh, played around with the fair, let's continue with the story, shall we? Oh, why don't... Okay, so they're still setting up. Oh, yeah, I need to talk to someone in the fair over here. I think it's you? hope it doesn't blow up like all the others. They ought to be ready now. Make for the far side for the square. This is gonna be fun. Come on, Chrono. Alright, let's go have uh, fun. Cause that's what we do. So let's go over here. Hold your horses. I want some candy. Oh, do you now? Alright, so I guess you just gotta stand here and look at all the candy. Lollipops, cotton candy. If you try to move, you will, uh, she'll be like, wait a minute, wait a minute. Okay, so, look at that. Thanks for waiting. No problem. I'm a gentleman, alright? I just met you. I just met you, alright? And, uh, basically, uh, yeah. Me and you can be friends. That's how that goes. And there's Luca's dad. T Tabin. Tabin. And Luca. 
step right up. Any of you who who have the time and the courage, our super dimensional warp is the invention of the century. To use a jump in here. And you'll be teleported here. It's a masterwork of my beautiful daughter, Luca. Look, there she is over there. Check out that girl's glasses. Give it a try, kid. Oh, it's you, Chrono. Yeah, I'll give it a try. She can probably see the backside of the moon with those. And look who it is. Oh, she's talking about her glasses. No, Chrono. Where have you been? No one wants to try the telepod. How about you? Yeah, it looks like fun on watching you try it. Alright, let's try it. Just hop into the left pod. Well, what about if I want to hop into the right pod? What about if I want to hop... I'm going gonna, I'm gonna... to... Come on, pod me up. Alright, just, let's just hope no flies get in, in here. We tried on our pets, and there's no reason it shouldn't work on humans as well. Step right up. Alright, fine. Alright, let's just hope there's no flies. I don't want to turn into a half fly, half man. Half red headed boy. Look at that, it worked! Holy crap! That was awesome! Anyways, I'm going to end the episode here, and then the next episode, we will test out the machine again or continue having fun at the fair because nothing can possibly go wrong. This has been Kenshin1913. I'll see you later. Bye bye.